This week, we're going to pray that cynicism can be taken from our mind. Now, I am not just preaching here. I am praying for myself. Often when you grow older, you have a been there, done that attitude. And when someone presents an idea that you've tried, you think, huh, and you have all this cynicism come in your mind. Often that blocks us from our good. It's like when Jesus took out the fishermen and they said, no, we've fished this. We've fished it over and over again. There are no fish here. And he said, put down your nets one more time. And they had such a big catch that time that it almost sunk the boat. Well, in many times in our lives, when we allow the touch of God to come in on something that we've tried before, uh, there is great success. Let us pray. Dear God, I pray once and for all that I can eliminate cynicism from my mind that I will not automatically think negative about some thing or subject or person. I pray that I'll have an open mind. I ask that you touch my mind, touch the ideas in my mind, and create in me a new thought structure that will be open and receptive to positive ideas, new ideas, or new ideas about old ideas. I pray that cynicism, through your touch, God, can be totally eliminated. I pray that the purifying white light of God will come through my mind and eliminate the dark places in me that I have held on to almost as a crutch, almost as a safety mechanism in a memory bank of things that have been tried and failed and therefore don't try again. I pray, God, that I will be open, that I will not block myself, that I will see things in a new way through your way, through your vision and your receptivity. I pray in this week, that cynicism will be taken from me, and in my free will, I agree to this happening once and for all. I don't want to be held in the past. I especially don't want to hold myself in the past. God, touch my mind. Make my mind new. May I have that mind that was in Christ Jesus. May I have a mind that is always open to new and better ideas. I pray for this elimination of cynicism in Jesus Christ's name. Amen.